This is an otherwise asymptomatic five-year-old male who was born at 28 weeks gestation. There is profound periventricular white matter volume loss, worse in the periatrial regions of the right greater than left cerebral hemispheres. There is ex vacuo dilatation of the lateral ventricles at those sites. There are no suspicious abnormalities on the diffusion weighted images. There was volume loss within the mid and posterior body of the corpus callosum. The findings are compatible with periventricular white matter injury of prematurity, which falls under the classification of periventricular leukomalacia. In addition to volume loss, other imaging features include cystic cavitations and periventricular cyst formation. Periventricular white matter injury of prematurity is more common in patients born before 33 weeks gestation and weighing less than 1,500 grams at birth. Over 50% of affected patients will be diagnosed with cerebral palsy or visual field deficits. The disease likely results from hypoxic ischemic injury to the watershed areas, which are located in the periventricular regions in infants. Early on, periventricular white matter necrosis is seen with cyst formation in the subacute phase and parenchymal volume loss with ex vacuo dilatation of the ventricles in the late phase.